Well, something interesting has happened with my uh, sorting system. I think it's got something to do with the fact that my rotten flesh is completely overloaded. I should have been emptying it out, I suppose. But I started collecting items in this bin that is not gunpowder. And this one as well. That's actually not supposed to happen. You can see here I'm getting items that aren't that don't belong. So what I've done is I tunneled in behind where I had it all sealed off to see what's going on. And sure enough, well I don't have this covered now. So what happened is the droppers actually just tossing stuff everywhere. I went back too far. That's the dropper here. I can actually cover that in. That'll help force some of these items down into the uh, proper trough. So they slide along. I got a position out of way to where I start my chest. So this is the first chest, and this is supposed to be the hopper that seals items from giving um, the type of item. It takes 45 items to seal off this hopper, but it's failing because it's overloaded with rotten flesh. So this one, something catastrophic happened here because none of my placekeepers are there at all. So everything is falling into that hopper, same as that one. This one's missing items, so it's also allowing extra items to fall in instead of what was dedicated to that slot. This is normal. 44 plus 1 iron locks this hopper into an iron only chest. And that's what it's supposed to look like. And anytime iron slides by, it'll grab it out of there. So, I gotta do some repairs on that. Um, shouldn't take too long. I'll have to re establish. I'm still not at level 33. I was trying to level up to join my bows together when I noticed what was going on with my hopper system. So I'm going to spend some time today fixing that. Okay, so I think I got it figured out. The problem with my chest uh, system. I'm pretty sure it was because of that rotten flesh chest in front being completely overloaded. It backfilled. You can hear the dropper just a given her right now, spreading these drops. Got some... I'm not sure what it would be spreading. Yeah, so it's counting up flesh right now, so the dropper is still working. And my solution was to add a second row of chests down below. So I've added another hopper below the one that feeds this chest row. Below it, and then it feeds the next chest row. So I have doubled the capacity of my uh, system here. So all of the new drops have to fill the bottom chest first. So since I've made the modification... Oh, that isn't right. This is not looking good right here. There's a potato at the bottom, but a cobblestone as well. You have to keep an eye on that. I use these uh, cobblestone slabs as my keepers on the sorting hopper. Uh, I just probably haven't had a chicken yet to drop, so or a carrot. <clears throat> I'm still getting overflow though, so this has me wondering. The next time I design this system, what I'm going to do is when I'm killing that many zombies at one time, there's so many rotten flesh coming by that the hopper can only except one at a time and the other ones just float past and of course they're ignored by all of these and it ends up in the overflow bin so what I think I'll do the next time I do a sorting system is I'm gonna double up on the ones that I know produce a lot and you can get multiples in rotten flesh for sure if there's lots of creepers up there I'll get multiples in gunpowder and bones. So these first four basically, the ones that are the primary drops of these creatures. The skeletons drop bones and arrows. Creepers will drop the uh, gunpowder. And zombies drop rotten flesh and then some of the other minor items. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two in a row. I'll have like two for rotten flesh, two for gunpowder, 
which means I'll have to extend it even farther, but that's all right. It's just uh, easier if it's all together when I go to load up. And this one here I see is filling up pretty fast, so if I don't get a cleric in my research lab pretty quick, I am going to need to start hauling some of this away or it's just going to overflow the system again.